Uh, Micah, the city had drilled some small holes on the other side of the parking lot here at Casa Romantica so it could monitor any type of movement that was happening underground. They're stressing tonight that had nothing to do with today's landslides. Rather, they say it's likely the saturated soil. A huge section of ground below Casa Romantica, an historic site here in San Clemente, gave way early this afternoon. About um, uh, 10 to 15 feet of the back terrace has just fallen. Um, we actually have red tagged the building, so basically telling everybody they need to get out. City engineers say there was actually a much smaller slide on this two and a half acre property early this morning, but that it really let loose about 12 hours later. After our recent heavy rains, public work started noticing cracks and fissures on the property more than a week ago and had been monitoring the site ever since. The slope has been moving for a week and a half now, so we thought at some point it might show more dramatic movement and it did today. This property was once the home of the city's founder and has been used as an event center with weddings on the terrace right up until last weekend. This slide, though, has not only closed Casa Romantica, it's also stopped train service again along the coast. This is the third rail closure in two years. And unfortunately, this time, this is a much more severe closure because the debris being so close and literally on the tracks at this point. Because of the direction of this slide, eight condos to the north have been red and yellow tagged. We, walked, we went and walked on the water and I said, oh, that doesn't look good. There Rita Vandermeulen lives that. in the Villa Grande condos just to the south. She says she's not worried. We're so set back, it's okay. The marine monument's there, and that's all built, you know, on stable. So you don't feel endangered at all? Not at all. Not at all. We're told that Casa Romantica will remain closed while city officials now try to figure out what steps to take forward. And we mentioned those eight condos that had been red and yellow tagged just to the north of here. I've just been told that the whole building now has been red tagged and about a dozen people are being evacuated as we speak. We're expecting Mayor Duncan and other city officials to be out here tomorrow morning. In San Clemente, I'm Rick Chambers. Guys, I'll throw it back to you in Hollywood. All right, Rick, thank you. Let's